green to roll in pure on the map. <laughs> right guys, I've got about 40 yards to the flag. T-shot was good, just got over this like ravine thing. So 40 yards to the flag, hopefully it spins. New to these greens here in America, so. Yeah, I think I've left it a bit short there, but we'll have to see. Fairly long birdie putt, but it's a birdie putt. First hole on American soil. <laughs> Got my tour strike here, let's read the green. Pretty straight, moving slightly right to left. Let's get the pace right. Not bad, not bad. Stress free par on the first. Well, welcome back guys. It's been a little while, hasn't it? And it's different. I'm here in uh, Arizona, in uh, Phoenix. I'm here for a couple of days, for a few days, and I'm going to uh, Palm Springs. But yeah, so we're doing a break 40 today. I actually just made a par off the first. Um, couldn't film the first shot because there was a starter there, but yeah, good drive. I made, made a tapping par, that is what we want. It's St. Marcos, uh, St. Marcos, St. Marcos Golf Course, really nice. Uh, it's in great condition. Not quite the weather, it is spitting a little bit, but we're here, we're playing golf. I've been playing a little favour with my driver. Just straight away par four. That might have cut a tiny bit too much, but it was good, good strike. Well guys, we're back and we've got cart cam. We've got cart cam. Uh, so yeah, not a bad uh, drive. I think it probably bounced in the fairway, might have just rolled off into the rough, uh, but we'll have to go and have a look. So, we'll see, but yeah, it's great to be back guys. Almost at 500 subscribers, which is class. Yeah, I'm back, I'm gonna make as much content as I can as the weather gets better in the UK too. It rolled off the fairway, it's crept into this like marsh stuff here, well not marsh stuff, like dirt. That's a terrible strike, guys, but it's out. <laughs> right, guys, I've ended up here. Just got a 52. I'm gonna bounce it just short, and hopefully it run, runs just on. I can make that. I can make that. A bit more than I'd like left for par. But we can do it. Greens are rolling pure on the map. Putting's the best part about my game, and I've just picked these up as well today. These are my fun. Level answer. I think that's good. So yeah guys, par three, off of the blues, which is um, equivalent to the whites in England, or at least it is at this course. Um, <laughs> I hit a five, because I thought I'm not gonna go through it and hit it as hard as I can. And it felt like a tiny bit thin, but if it's not in this front bunker, it's money. It's in the bunker. <laughs> yeah, I've just come up a tiny bit shy, because I didn't hit it full or at all really. Look how pure these greens are. I mean, I've just knifed it off the back, but, well, not knifed it, it was a good shot, but it's just off the back. Just got to get this to bounce and roll out. Oh, oh. oh my God. Oh, wow. That's typical. That would have been a class par. We've got this coming back for bogey now. Just hit that flag and it's rolled on. Ah, uh, didn't break. Well, that's a double. 
Back to two over round three now. It's unlucky. Right guys, a lovely looking hole. 460 yards straight away. Not fading. Good strike, but double cross really. I set up for a fade and hit a draw. I can't tell you how good this is, guys. I've wanted to play in America forever. And yeah, the courses are just pure, man. <laughs> no, it's class. But I'm out here on my own, and do you know what? I'm loving it, like honestly loving it. Um, I've hit that drive very well, but unfortunately I would have caught these trees on the left. Hopefully drop down and give me a line. Uh, but again, good strike, so can't complain too much. We're two over round three, not the best because of that double. And I can see my ball uh, just here. And I think there is a nice little line. Bit of a disadvantage, guys, is that I don't have any yardages and there's not really any sort of stakes here. Um, but I've got a five iron, I'm just going to punch it low and here it's maybe 160. No, right, that better see it. I'll be in some trouble there. From trouble to trouble here, guys. Avoiding all the good bits. <laughs> got 52, we're about 50 yards away. Nowhere near enough. Nowhere near enough. Blimey. Up and down for a bogey, that'll be... It's what we're looking for, but it's not even that. It's going to be good enough. It's just terrible, really, but we'll see what we can do. Right, sitting up nice, guys. Got 52. You know what it is. Short game chef. That vibe. It's got a bit to run out. That's good. Tiny bit right, but it's good. this for the bogey save. It's always going in if you start it on the line. Get it. Sun's coming out. It's cactus vibes here in Arizona. I don't know. I'm playing golf. I don't really know what gets any better than this. I've got a par five now. It's quite a short one as well. 460 yards, uh, 70 yards. So we might be all right. Get away. If we can make a birdie and get one back, that'd be unbelievable. And one thing I will say is, I'm loving life. New clubs, by the way, that'll be a video coming in itself. This is the ball I'm using, tour response, for anyone who wants to know. But yeah, loving it. And that thing is so American. <laughs> Wouldn't mind a house like that with a pool just overlooking a golf course. Eh? Like I said, guys, straight away par five. Bad situation again, the driver's not quite been at it yet. Got a five iron. I'm gonna try and run one, cut it a little bit, but just keep one low and knock it back out there so I can get on the green on the next. That's not cutting. But it's fine, because we didn't strike it too well. We're back in the fairway. Yeah, not brought, bringing the best stuff yet, but still, bogey on the last. We're three over round four. Let's make a birdie, come on. Right, I've got a 52 degree. Basically a full swing, caught the edge of the rough. Go, go. Yes. Oh wow. I could be a tiny bit long, could be long but, could be long but it's good. Right, I've got a little way in here down the hill guys, uh, but it's for a birdie. Good par. If you put yourself out of position like that off the tee, guys, you can only expect to unfortunately um, not make a birdie. But you know, we're now three over round five, so it's good. So, level par around here is 36. So, I'm now. Yeah, three over, so basically I need to par uh, six, seven, eight, and nine uh, to break 40. So it's a tough one, but I actually think I can do it. It's coming together. This next one's pretty open. Um, I think we've got it, in, got it in us, guys. 
I'm loving being back. Filming videos is, I love it. Um, sorry for being gone for such a while, guys. Uh, had a lot of stuff on, getting married, so uh, stuff with that going on. But yeah, so, but we're back. So hopefully we can, um, we can get a good one away. Yeah, that one was struck much better, but again, faded slightly. Um, I think it would have bounced in the fairway, but could have just crept into the rough. Right guys, so I actually caught the fairway. Something going on. It's, <laughs> it's America though, scary place, man. I've got a nine iron. I want to get it over that bunker, really. It's a back pin. I think nine iron's enough, but again, I don't know how far we are. Is that it? I think that's a little bit short. Well, I mean, it's on the green, but a little bit short, but you know. Come on, guys. That is perfectly pin high. Seriously, guys, this would get us right back on track. No way. Tapping part, but that was a real chance. That was a real chance. That's I've let one go. I've let one go there. But we're okay, guys. We carry on. We move on. Hopefully, we can get a birdie on the next. We're still three over. Right, guys. It's a short-ish dog leg to the left. Cut off here. But if I can actually play a little bit of a draw, or even just pretty straight, I think I've got enough room up there be absolutely fine. That comes in straight. Is he going to run out of room? No, it's fine. Still a fairway bar? I speak in American because people are here. It's a fairway bar, man. You know, a lot of the people I've, well, I've spoken to a couple of people so far, like just playing around the course and that. They're all so nice. They're so nice. So like I said, a good, another ball in the fairway. I've got a six iron here. There's a bunker on the right, bunker on the left. It's quite actually protected. Struck it well. Yeah, I've come up short. Should have been a five iron, maybe more. Probably, well, if not definitely, it was a perfect shot, but just the wrong club. So I was weighing up whether to putt this or not, but I've got a 52 degree. And there's a little ridge, if I can get it over that, Good. Go in. <laughs> uh, it, it wasn't, it wasn't, well, it was close. Look, you'll see. There. Yeah. Good par there. Great par. Two holes left, guys. Um, par three now. Short par three, water in front um yeah so a tough one it's actually 150 yards 151 that's okay um but yeah guys it's so good to be back i'm loving making this content again it's so good um and i want to be more consistent it's just it was difficult over the winter but as the summer comes playing nine before nines all sorts um yeah so like i say i'm a nine handicapper now i want to get low i really want to go lower um the winter was tough to be honest, a lot of bad scores. <laughs> but yeah, we're just gonna keep it going. Um, and yeah, I'm loving it. Being in Arizona, going to Palm Springs next week, um, or later on in, in the, well, actually Saturday. Um, so yeah, gonna bring as many videos out as I possibly can. Things guarded, water at the front, um, and on the right. I think there's bunkers left. I've got a seven iron. These clubs are more lofted. I've lost a bit of distance. I'm not compressing it enough. So at the moment I am hitting less club, I have more club than I maybe need to. Bounce on the right side. Bounce on the right side of the green. Might have just rolled off because it is like a upside down um, bowl type green. I'm using 52 much more these days around the green, which I'm going to now. Just bounce on the right side and rolled on. 
This is amazing. Like, I can't believe, I can't describe to you how happy I am. I love this. Right, I'm green side. A lot may pluck this, but it is a bit thick. So I've got my 52 degrees. That's too long. Stop. Thin, a little bit thin, and that's what happens, unfortunately, when the greens are rolling fast. But we can make it for a par, come on. We'd want to be much closer. Oh, just not enough break. Didn't play enough. Just like that, you make a bogey, guys. I now need a birdie on the last to break 40. <laughs> I need a birdie. It's a short par five to finish. So this could set up quite nicely. Well, it might be ever so slightly right. I'm not sure how this works, this hole, but it was a really good drive. But as I'm coming up, there is a ravine here, which I didn't know about. Uh, <laughs> but we'll see. Hopefully we're not in it. We might be. Who knows? I've actually carried the ravine. Um, I'm striking it well today. You'll probably notice that I'm only coming up to about here on the backswing, but that's because when I'm coming up high, because I'm not compressing the ball enough at the moment, um, I end up flapping it and it just it goes so high. Um, so I'm sort of trying to compete, com keep right now a compact swing until I've grinded on the range to com be compressing it a bit more. Um, I don't know the distance at all, but I've got a seven iron. But I think I'm gonna hit a six, because I don't know it at all, but. Par five, I've got a six iron in, which is great. Because it's rolled a long way past that ravine. Um, yeah, let's make it, let's try and get on a two. Eagle putt. <laughs> no, we need a birdie though. Oh, left it out right, but... I don't know how right that green goes, but I've taken it slightly over those trees. Uh, let's hope we can get up and down for a birdie. Guys, it's crazy that this is what it's come down to. Up and down over the bunker for a birdie to break 40. Ah, no, I've got to make a long putt now to break 40. And that is not ideal. I've got about 25 foot here for a birdie. If I make this subscribe, if I don't, please still subscribe. Just rolled on. Well, not even the roll on, but unfortunately. Anyway, a par which puts me at 40. Me today, guys, made a 40, unfortunately. That par three sort of killed me, not getting up and down. There were a couple of shots I left out there, but um, like that birdie that just went pie. Um, but 40, 40. So that's four over, round nine. Um, hope you enjoyed the video. If you have, subscribe. I'm back. I'm going to produce loads of content here in America. Um, but yeah, cheers, guys. See you on the next one.